Welcome back, everyone. The Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, as you know, is one of our top gems in town. And its latest artist in residence this summer is so excited to be back in Northeast Ohio. Joining me live this morning is Karina Eleni. Good morning, Karina. Thanks so much for being on our show. Thank you. Good morning. How are you? Great. So tell me a little bit about you growing up. Where did you grow up? How would you get to this point at the Rock Hall? So I grew up in Los Angeles, California, and I swear from the beginning that I was born, I was always singing. I was always humming. My mom used to say I would harmonize in the car and she's like, who is this kid? So I've always been singing and I have always loved writing music. And I'm at NYU for college and I got an email from one of my professors saying, hey, you guys should all apply to this program at the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. And as soon as I saw it, I was like, I have to apply to this program. And I'm I'm so happy that I got it. It's very, it's a very special program. And it's a homecoming for you. We've got to talk about your mom, Akron Zone, Melina Kanakaridis, yeah. a TV star performer that I admired growing up. And you came here often with mom to see your family, right? What does Northeast oh, Ohio yeah. mean to you? We would come all the time if it was for summer or definitely Christmas and New Year's. And for me, Northeast Ohio is like my second home. Like sometimes it's almost my like real home because all my family's here. My grandmother's here. My dad's side is from Columbus. So all of Ohio is my family. And, you know, I just remember being with my family and walking around and we would have family dinners and sometimes we'd go to Swenson's for fun and just being in like Akron with everyone and you know, having fun, special family time. That's that's what Ohio is. It's it's my family. <laughs> we love having you here with your family. And tell me about making music here in Ohio. At the, at the Rock Hall, you're really doing a lot this summer. It is just so inspiring. I was, I've been telling my friends and everyone that every second that I'm at the Rock Hall, I'm constantly inspired because, you know, I have all these artists that I look up to, their outfits, their original songwriting books, just right there in my face. And I've gotten to really love my Thursday mornings because from 9 to 12, I'm in the jam room and I get to write music and collaborate with the other artists and residents. And I'm just like excited to drive home and write music. It's just such a inspiring, thrilling feeling. And it's just awesome. I, I love this program more than anything. If I could close my eyes and write out a program, it would be this. So I'm I'm really enjoying my time here. It's awesome. And folks can come out and hear you sing, kind of see what you're doing at the Rock Hall. Tell us when we can come watch you. Yeah. So I have three more shows and then our final show. I'll be performing August 2nd, August 9th, and August 10th. And the, the August 2nd performance is three to five in the beer garden. August 9th is 12 to 2, and August 10th is 3 to 5. And it's in their plaza, their beer garden, so you can go get a drink or some food and just sit here and listen to me for two hours sing. And I'm going to be doing a lot of original music of mine and then a few covers of the inductees of the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. So it's, it's really fun. Karina, we're going to put all that info online. I have to come see you in a show because it sounds like yes. so much fun. Thank you so much for being with us. And all the best to Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. What a young talent with Northeast Absolutely. Ohio roots. Yay. I love it. And as I was saying, I, I totally looked up to her mama Aww. growing up. I, I was like a little, I want to be on TV kid. And, <laughs> and her mom was, you know, an Akron native. And it was like, so cool. Oh, that's so sweet. Very <laughs> yeah. full circle moment. Totally.